Today, we're diving into a topic that's all too familiar to anyone who loves streaming, gaming, or browsing the web without limitations, and that's geoblocking. Have you ever tried to watch a show or access a website only to find out that it's blocked in your country? It's pretty annoying, right? Well, in today's video, we're gonna tackle geoblocking head on. I'll explain what it is, why it exists, and most importantly, how to bypass it in 2024 and beyond. So by the end, you'll know how to get around geoblocking using three of the best VPNs available on the market today, ExpressVPN, NordVPN, and Surfshark. Ready to unlock the internet? Let's go ahead and get started. What exactly is geoblocking? In simple terms, geoblocking is a way for websites and online services to restrict access to certain content based on your location. If you've ever tried to stream a show on Netflix, only to be told that it's not available in your region, that's geoblocking and action. It's essentially an invisible barrier that keeps you from seeing content that companies have only licensed for certain areas of the world. So how does geoblocking work? Geoblocking works by identifying your location based on several data points. IP address tracking. So your IP address, which is a unique identifier for your internet connection, reveals your general location, like your country or city. Websites use this information to decide if you should be allowed access to specific content. Content. GPS data. Some apps, particularly mobile apps, can access your device's GPS location to pinpoint your exact area. If your GPS location doesn't match the required region, then you're out of luck. Payment information. Some platforms verify your location through your payment details. For example, if you try to use a credit card from a different country, they may block you based on the bank's registered location. These methods make it possible for websites and apps to determine where you are and what you should or what you shouldn't be allowed to see. So why does geoblocking exist? So now that we know how it works, let's look at why geoblocking exists in the first place. It may be frustrating, but there are a few key reasons why companies rely on it. Copyright and licensing agreements. Now, when it comes to media like movies, TV shows, and music, licensing agreements are everything. A show might be available in Europe, but not in the US because the streaming platform only holds the rights for certain regions. Regional pricing. Some services use geoblocking to enforce regional pricing differences. By controlling which regions have access, they can set prices based on local markets. For instance, let's Let's say a subscription might be cheaper in one country than another, and geoblocking ensures that users don't cross virtual borders to get better prices. Legal restrictions. Some countries restrict certain types of content, whether it's news, social media, or entertainment. Geoblocking helps these platforms comply with local laws by preventing users in restricted areas from accessing particular content. While these reasons may make sense from a company's point of view, they're frustrating for users who just want access to the same content that everyone else has. That's where VPNs come in. Taking a look at outdated methods to bypass geoblocking. So before we get into the best methods for bypassing geoblocking, let's go over some older methods that aren't as effective anymore. Number one is proxy servers. So proxy servers were once popular for masking your IP address. They can make it look like you're browsing from a different location, but most streaming platforms like Netflix, Hulu, and Disney Plus have gotten really good at detecting and blocking proxies. Smart DNS. So smart DNS reroutes only certain parts of your internet traffic to change your apparent location. While it's faster than a proxy, streaming services can often detect and block smart DNS as well. Tor network. So Tor was another option for bypassing geoblocks, but it's not ideal for streaming. Tor is incredibly slow and doesn't allow you to choose a specific location, which makes it frustrating for most content needs. Each of these methods has become less effective over time as websites and streaming platforms have improved their geoblocking technology. So what's the best way to bypass geoblocking in 2024? So the best answer is VPNs or virtual private networks. VPNs let you connect to the internet through a server in a different country, masking your IP address so that it looks like you're browsing from a different location. And the VPNs that do it the best are ExpressVPN, NordVPN, and Surfshark. So why use a VPN? Well, VPNs are superior to those older methods like proxies or smart DNS for a few reasons. The first one's reliability. VPN
VPN providers are constantly updating their software and servers to stay one step ahead of streaming platforms detection methods. Number two is security. VPNs encrypt your data, which keeps your online activity private and secure. This isn't something that proxies or smart DNS can do as effectively. Speed. Unlike Tor, many VPNs are optimized for streaming, so you won't experience the slowdowns associated with other methods. So now let's dive into why ExpressVPN, NordVPN, and Surfshark are the best options for bypassing geoblocks in 2024. Top three VPNs for bypassing geoblocking. Each of these VPNs has unique strengths, so let's break down what makes ExpressVPN, NordVPN, and Surfshark the top choices. ExpressVPN. So ExpressVPN is known for its lightning fast speeds and ease of use, which makes it ideal for streaming, gaming, and bypassing geoblocks. Here's why it's one of the top choices when it comes to a VPN. Top level security. ExpressVPN uses military grade encryption, DNS IPv6 leak protection, and an automatic kill switch to ensure that your data stays private. Global server network. With servers in over 100 countries, ExpressVPN lets you access content from nearly anywhere in the world. 24 seven customer support. ExpressVPN offers round the clock live support to help you with any issues. ExpressVPN is also known for its reliable connection and minimal buffering, making it a top choice for streaming. Plus, it comes with a 30 day money back guarantee, so you can try it out risk free. So if you wanna get started with ExpressVPN, we'll have a link for it down in the description below. When you click on that link, it's gonna bring you to this page right here, where you just click on get ExpressVPN. And at the time of recording, ExpressVPN is currently running their Black Friday deal, so you can get some of the best pricing that you can expect all year. So when you sign up for their two year plan, you're gonna get six months free, bringing it down to $4.99 per month effectively. They also have an option here if you wanna sign up for only one year, you can go ahead and get four months free, bringing that to an effective $6.25 per month. So if you wanna get started with ExpressVPN at the best pricing possible, then go ahead and click the link down below in the description. Number two, NordVPN. So NordVPN is another excellent choice with over 6,600 servers across over 110 countries. It's frequently ranked as one of the most secure VPNs available. And here's what sets it apart, threat protection. So NordVPN offers built-in ad blocking and malware protection, even when you're not connected to the VPN. They also have MeshNet. So this feature allows you to connect to remote devices securely, which is useful if you wanna create a private network with friends or family. They also have their very own Nord Linux protocol. It's built on the WireGuard protocol. So the Nord Linux provides ultra fast speeds, making it perfect for streaming content smoothly. NordVPN also offers a dedicated IP option if you want added security, plus a 30 day money back guarantee. And if you catch it during a sale, you can go ahead and get it at a significant discount like right now. So if you wanna get started with the best pricing for NordVPN, just click the link down below in the description. That's gonna bring you to this page right here and just go ahead and click on this red button, get the deal to go ahead and take advantage of the Black Friday savings. And here you can go ahead and choose from one of NordVPN's four different plans. There's the basic, standard, complete, and prime. Go ahead, read through these different features here and see which ones are most important to you and go ahead and select that plan. One thing to be mindful of is up here in the top left corner, you can go ahead and select the term that you wanna to commit to. There's a two year plan, a one year plan, and a one month plan. For this option, we'll go ahead and select the two year plan and the standard as that is their most popular plan and click on buy now. So as you can see for only $91.53, you're gonna get two years to NordVPN. And that includes those four extra months, which brings it down to an effective price of 327 per month. Again, NordVPN also has a 30 day money back guarantee so you can try it out, see if it's right for you and make your decision within those first 30 days. To get started, click the link down below in the description. And number three, we have Surfshark. So Surfshark is known for its affordability and unlimited device connections. This VPN is perfect if you wanna secure multiple devices or share your account with family. Here's what makes it a top pick. Unlimited devices. Surfshark allows unlimited simultaneous connections, which is a big plus for households or anyone with lots of devices. It has Nexus technology. So this feature routes your traffic through multiple servers, maximizing your protection. They also have their clean web feature. So Surfshark includes built-in ad blocking and anti-tracking technology so that you can browse without the annoyance of ads. 
Surfshark's 30-day money-back guarantee and competitive pricing also make it a popular choice for those budget-conscious users who still want a reliable and secure VPN experience. So to get started with Surfshark, go ahead and click the link down below in the description, which will bring you to this page right here. Just go ahead and click on Get Surfshark, and it'll bring you to their different plans here. So Surfshark has three different plans, the Surfshark Starter, Surfshark One, and Surfshark One Plus. Again, you can also choose the term that you want to commit to, whether that's 24 months, 12 months, or one month. For this example, we'll go ahead and choose their most popular plan, the Surfshark 1 and 24 month option and click on get one. And then you can see for here for only $69.72, you're going to go ahead and get two full years to Surfshark VPN. Again, be sure to click the link down in the description to get started. How to use a VPN to bypass geoblocking. So using a VPN to bypass geoblocking is easier than you might think. And here's a quick step-by-step -step guide to get you started. First, download the VPN by using one of the links we shared down in the description. So start by downloading your chosen VPN app, whether it's ExpressVPN, NordVPN, or Surfshark. Now, instantly, installation for these apps are super simple and straightforward. Just create an account and sign up for a subscription like we just walked through. Each of these VPNs offer trial periods or money back guarantees so you can try them risk free. Next, just connect to a server. Open up the app and choose a server in the country where the content that you want to access is available. For instance, if you want to watch UK Netflix, connect to a UK server. Clear cookies and cache. Now, some websites use cookies to track your location, so it's a good idea to clear them before streaming. Enjoy your content. Now, once connected, head to your streaming site or website and you're good to go. If you encounter issues, just try switching servers until you find one that works. Extra tips for using VPNs to bypass geoblocking. Here are a few additional tips to help you get the most out of your VPN experience. Reconnect if blocked. Now, some streaming sites like Netflix occasionally block VPN IP addresses. If this happens, just disconnect and reconnect to get a new IP address. Use dedicated IPs. So if you're using NordVPN, for example, consider a dedicated IP for extra security in a smoother experience. Clear cache regularly. Regularly clearing your cache and cookies can help reduce location conflicts when accessing restricted content. Is bypassing geoblocking legal? Now, one last thing to consider. Is bypassing geoblocking even legal? In most places, using a VPN to access content from another region isn't illegal, but it may go against the terms of service for some streaming platforms. So always check the rules in your country and on the service that you're accessing to avoid any potential issues. And that's it. Now you know what geoblocking is, why it exists, and how to bypass it using ExpressVPN, NordVPN, or Surfshark. Now each of these VPNs offers a unique mix of speed, security, and server options. So you can enjoy the freedom to access content from anywhere in the world. Now, if you want to get started with any of the VPNs that we talked about today, you'll find links for them down in the description below. Now, these are affiliate links, which means that we earn a small commission when you use these links, but at no extra cost to you. And in fact, these links are going to get you the best pricing possible. So be sure to check them out. And it's these commissions that really help support the channel and allow us to continue creating free content just like this. So if you end up using them, we thank you so much in advance. Now, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so that you never miss another video. Here on this channel, we cover everything from VPNs and cybersecurity to how to stay safe online and detailed product comparisons. So be sure to subscribe. But other than that, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video.